the, the ladder was up and the, the chain was wrapped around it and there was padlock on it, there was no way that you could get it, get it down, not with a set of bolt cutters, hacksaw, or, or a key. <laughs> Tense moments for Blair Parsons, who was forced to cut his way to safety to escape the fire that broke out at Shamrock Hotel on Tuesday. I went through the window, and when I got to the fire escape, the fire escape was chained, <laughs> chained up. So, chained and padlocked. So, uh, I was standing on it. I jumped on it a couple of times, see, but there was nothing. There was no way that it had come down. Now, Blair wasn't the only one desperate to get out. Fire crews were called at 6.45 in the morning. When they arrived, they described it as a fishbowl effect with people desperate to escape. We've, we've heard that report and some others. Our investigators looking at that right now. All that information will be packaged together during the investigation. The Calgary Fire Department said 11 people were inside at the time. All made it out safely, but three were taken to hospital for observation. Fire damage involves uh, at least two suites, and most of the damage is going to be heavy smoke damage throughout the hotel. The Calgary Fire Department would not comment on the chain fire escape. However, they did say that safety codes are something they're going to be looking into as this investigation unfolds. For Sun News, I'm Michael Wood.